Hi, this is Dr. Pan, host of Tucson Math Doc channel on YouTube. We have an interesting problem here today. It says find the area of a special rhombus. Now, if you remember, rhombus is a is a four sides all equal. Um, equal. Let's let's actually draw it out here. So four sides must be equal. Now, rhombus is not a kite. Okay, a kite has requirements that only two sides equal. Rhombus is actually four sides. Obviously, we're given this is a 120. That leaves this one 60. Okay, since this one's a six, and it says each side is the same, and the, the six centimeters on each side. So let's put the units here. Centimeters. Okay, six. Now this one happened to be a very interesting one because if you notice. This is a 60 degrees. Half of this one is 60. So in essence, you actually have a very special triangle, what we call the equilaterals. Each side is the same. Okay, this is 60 degrees, and this is 60 degrees. So is this one. How I got this one is because the rhombus has requirement that the opposite angle is the same. That leaves this one 60 degrees. Okay. And Given this one is 6 and this one is 6, and this is 60 degrees, and because those two sides are the same, the isosceles triangle says this angle must equal to this angle. And using the geometry here, it turned out this is actually an isosceles triangle. So therefore, the area of the rhombus is twice of the area of the triangle. Okay, now all we have to do is find the area of the triangle. And since it's a special triangle, it's actually pretty easy to find. Okay, this is 6, this is 6. Because it's all 60 degrees, all sides are the same, so this one is 6 as well. Okay, the area of the triangle is equal to half base, which is 6, times height. Now, how do we find a height? Here's the height. Okay. Since the triangle is a isosceles triangle, uh, half, the height divides the base into half. So using Pythagorean theorem, you can say height is equal to 36, which is 6 squared, minus 3 squared, which is 9. So this is a radical of 27. Let's simplify a, a little bit. 3 times 9, so this becomes 3 radical of 3. Area is equal to half times 6 times 3 radical of 3. And then we have half of 18 radical 3. Okay, I didn't divide this 18 out because I know area of the rhombus is equal to twice of area of the triangle. So 2 times half of 18 radical 3, the answer is 18 radical 3. Let's put the units squared back in there. All right, hope this helped. Have a confident day.